This is Abe Pretanzer from Awards Radar, and I'm so thrilled to be speaking with Tony Shalhoub and Maren Hinkle yeah. uh, about yeah. the marvelous Mrs. Maisel. How are you both doing today? Good. We like Good. your name. We love your name, Abe, Abe. Abe. Oh, of course. Yes. Well, I mean, I think Abe is, we can start by saying, I think Abe is, is the best character, at least the best name on the show. Of course. <laughs> the name is perfect. How much are you both, how much are you both like your own characters on this series? Oof. I, I don't know that I am a lot like Abe. Um, I mean, Abe's way smarter than I am. Um, but and, uh, and but I guess we do we do intersect in certain areas. Um, Abe is kind of a a perfectionist, right? A mm -hmm. bit of mm -hmm. maybe a little mm -hmm. fastidious. Um, I in some ways Abe is way smarter than me and in some ways he's a little less aware of mm -hmm. the world around him mm -hmm. than I am but um it's been an interesting it's been an interesting kind of interplay between the character and my own personality and I feel like um my similarity to Rose I'm a mom I love my kid she's a mom I think she loves her kids that might be where it ends. <laughs> <laughs> I don't feel it all similar. And by the way, I think she's awesome. Like I like her more than I like myself. <laughs> I just thought I'd rather be her than me at times. And I love the way she dresses, mind you. I have had a whole new rethinking of how one puts themselves together. I don't know how much I used to really un respect or understand or just, un yeah, I just didn't understand people that cared about what it meant to present to the outside world because I thought it took up a lot of time. But uh, she, she Marin, had a it. lot of help, it's right? I had it. a lot of good help. I saw Donna Zakowska who did this, you know, obviously the costume design and then all the amazing people that helped out. But I, I have to say it is kind of worth it because you feel, you know, the old like, you feel like what you look like or something? Is that a phrase? Did I just make that up? No, you that's just, the way it is. You just okay. made it You up. feel like what you look like. So uh, I think that because she looks kind of fabulous, she felt fabulous. So um, again, I'm not like that at all, but I, I would love to be more like that. Well, I do think both of them are very concerned about how they're perceived by others, which doesn't they stop are. them You're from, right. Oh my you God, know. the whole idea that in that last, see, is it the last season or is it the one before where they, they pretend that the apartment that their That's daughters offer to four. them yeah. is like yeah. literally, you know, uh, something that they are offering to her. <laughs> it's just amazing. Yeah. The lies that they tell their friends. I'm also always impressed by the rapid fire speed of the dialogue and I, my assumption that there have to be many, many takes involved because you can't possibly get everything out so so quickly and perfectly every time. Well, <clears throat> there, there are surprisingly uh, not that many takes, but there's a lot of rehearsal mm -hmm. uh, that goes into it so that we can keep the number of takes uh, down to a somewhat sane number. Um, but unlike most scripted shows, we we do rehearse. We do rehearse a lot, um, which I think is great. It's a it's kind of a luxury, and um, you know you can make most of your mistakes then. But then when the cameras roll, everybody tries to be a hundred percent, more than a hundred percent focused. You know, it's well, interesting. Yeah. I've never asked um, you guys, all the cast, this, but the first couple of years I was very aware of the speed. And uh, and Amy did in Dan too, we would finish a couple takes perhaps and they'd say, okay, that was great, faster. But in the, in the years that followed, I didn't really feel, I didn't feel that kind of hovering quality about um, being faster, faster, faster quite as much. Do you agree? It did, it did. Well, I think um, two Maybe things happened. Better, they right? eased up a little and also we just got more yeah, facile it. Right. at it. So You're right. so I think we our, our internal rhythms just just um, yeah. increased yeah. speed. This show has such a terrific ensemble and obviously you get to interact with a lot of people, but is there anyone in particular that you would have loved to see your characters share scenes with, but it never made sense for the story? Well, Lenny, um, would you? We we did work with Lenny briefly. I worked with yeah with with. Uh, oh, you Luke, did a couple times. Yeah, yeah. Luke yeah sorry, Kirby Luke. a couple yeah, times. Sorry. Wish I could have done more because he's just so delightful, mm -hmm. and I only really uh, didn't have that many one-on-one -on -one scenes with with uh, with Caroline, who plays Shirley, um, in um, in season uh, 
four. In season you had four, a when, when Moish was in the hospital, and she comes over to our apartment, and, and I think you guys have to go out. Yeah, and, yeah. To we kind of take at, the yes, yes, at her right. apartment. So uh, Abe is left alone with Shirley, which is, which is at first feels very awkward for mm -hmm. him, um, <clears throat> but uh, by the end of the scene, we see their their kind of connection. And, mm. and I kind of felt a bit of a longing that I wish I'd had more one-on-one -on -one, mm. uh, with Shirley. Mm. You know what? And also, she, uh, Caroline and Tony are really good friends from... We go way yeah, back. Yeah, they go way back and they Work do together. dog walks together. So it would be, that would have even endowed it with more. I just realized something. I don't think I had a scene or more than a few seconds that was just Michael and me. You've had some Michael scenes. I have, yeah. You have, but I didn't get those. I would have loved that. I think there would have been something fascinating about Rose like sitting down with her sort of ex-son-in-law and you know, kind of telling him like she believes it is. Um, that would have been great. I loved my scenes with Susie, with Alex. Yeah, I sure. got a few of them and each one I would sort of walk away and be like, please Amy, some more, some more, you know. So that, that was in, incredible. But it, honestly, every single person we got to work with, we're, we're now watching some of the last season and Jason Ralph, wait, has that been said? Yes, okay, no, I, was, I wasn't sure if it's, it's been said to the, to the public. Uh, Jason Ralph is in the show um, and, and Reed is in it. And these are people that we got to have briefly in the last scene, but, but I would have loved to be in some sort of more, you know, more scenes with those guys oh, as yeah. well. They're amazing. Congratulations on the great run, and thank you both so much for taking some time to speak with me today. Thanks. Thanks. Thanks, Abe. Thank you.